Welcome back to our channel, where we bring you the latest news in the world of technology. In today's video, we'll be talking about two of the biggest names in tech, Mark Zuckerberg and Elon Musk. Recently, it was reported that Zuckerberg is planning to launch a new social media platform to compete with Musk's Twitter. Let's dive in and find out more. Mark Zuckerberg, the CEO of Meta Platforms, which owns Facebook and Instagram, is reportedly building a new social media platform to compete with Twitter, which is owned by Elon Musk. It's no secret that the two billionaires have a frosty relationship, and with Musk's recent acquisition of Twitter for $44 billion, the competition for advertiser dollars and the attention of consumers and influencers is heating up. Musk has been finding new sources of revenue for Twitter by revamping its subscription service, Blue. He has incorporated a blue badge for verifying the identity of accounts, which allowed him to raise the monthly price for the service. Zuckerberg has also launched a similar service, Meta Verified, which offers users the chance to have their Facebook and Instagram accounts verified to prevent imposters and trolls. But now, Zuckerberg wants to go further and build a decentralized, text-based social network to directly compete with Twitter. The project, codenamed P92, is still in the preliminary stage and is being piloted by Adam Mosseri, who runs Instagram. It will specialize in text, much like Instagram specializes in photos. Decentralized social networks allow individual users to set up their own independent servers and set rules for content moderation avoiding centralized control of content. This means groups and communities can set their own rules without the risk of censorship. Decentralized social networks are popular in the cryptocurrency community and are promoted by crypto evangelists like Jack Dorsey, co-founder and former CEO of Twitter. Zuckerberg believes that there is an opportunity for a separate space where creators and public figures can share timely updates about their interests. He wants to appeal to people unhappy with Musk's direction of Twitter, where he has made the platform a bastion of conservatives who he says were muzzled under Twitter 1.0. If you found this video informative, please hit the like button and leave a comment below with your thoughts on Zuckerberg's new platform. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more updates on the latest in technology news.